see what's going on. Uh, I just did a review of the Panda Raspberry Combo. Um, honestly, I think this thing is pretty sweet for the price on Amazon. <clears throat> it's not bad. Came shipped in a nice box, easy to take out. Pretty much fully assembled. There's a little filter thing on the bottom to keep rodents out, depending on where you're gonna put it. Not too worried about it now, but basically I'm doing my first load of laundry in the travel trailer. Um, if you watch some of my other earlier videos, I modified this bathroom, built this cabinet. I still want to build, extend this butcher block right here because the panda lid only opens out to about here. So I'd gain about three more inches of space there. But anyway, this video is about the panda. Um, I'm very pleased with the way it's draining. Um, it's draining right now. And basically what I did is I added a Y to the sink drain. And then I found fitting to convert it to a threaded piece that had a blue and half inch uh, piece of PVC pipe. Um, from that piece of PVC pipe, was able to hose plant the uh, drain hose on and uh, seems to be working pretty good. Um, looks like I have a little bit of water. I'm not sure if that's just from the pressure or what. Um, to get the water flow, I added the T and then some elbows and that looks like the water is actually dripping from this valve so that's probably just not pushed on tight enough. Or screwed on there. Uh, like I said, this is the first test, and I'm kind of glad it's not leaking from the drain. It's just leaking from that fitting, so it just needs to be tightened. Um, basically, that's a washing machine valve to a garden hose to a faucet to the quick connect of the washer. Um, so this is the first test of the washer, you know, it holds 10 pounds. Basically what I have in there is a pair of jeans, a sweatshirt that's pretty heavy, a uh, bath towel, shirt, some socks. And um, really the test that I've been wanting to see is this right here, the spin cycle and how it affects the travel trailer. Um, I can kind of feel it, but I want to go out. Kai, can you feel that rocking the trailer? The spin cycle? Not really? Yeah, it's doing a pretty good job of just sort of um, absorbing the shock itself. So, anyway, just wanted to do a test. Seems to be working great. Um, need to adjust that fitting, but yeah, if you want a panda in your travel trailer, it is possible. And here's just kind of a back view. And <laughs> it did blow the quick connect when I was uh, training it and got everything a little bit wet, as you can see. But um, drips are gone, and uh, seems like everything's working great. Nice first run of the panda in the travel trailer. All right, YouTube, just want to let you know how uh, quiet the panda is. I'm going to stop talking and so you can hear. It's kind of low hum, not much different than the furnace. What I'm really pleased about though is there's no shaking. We don't feel the trailer shake. Do you guys feel the trailer shake? No. We don't feel the trailer shake. So it's doing its uh, air dry. And uh, this is great. Is it like this?